Yeah, here's the radio was lit. Honey, no people came outside, okay? And left my keys in the car. Locked my keys and my phone in the car by accident, of course. Can I vlog in peace, please? Thank you. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's back with another vlog. Whew, I'm out of breath. Hey y'all. Ooh, did y'all miss me? Did y'all miss me? Did y'all miss me? Hold on, let me sit y'all there. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh shit, hold on. Give me a second. I'm so happy to be back. Y'all. First of all, we on our way out the door. It's hot. Hold on. Girl, it's hot. Hold up. The fuck? Anyway, y'all, we about to go to the grocery store really quick to pick up a few things. But, y'all, I got so much to update y'all with because obviously I've been gone for like almost two weeks. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. But I have so much to update y'all with. So when we get home, well, when we get back from the grocery store, we're going to sit down and we're going to chat because I got some things that... <laughs> I gotta show y'all, it's a few things. It's at least like four or five things I need to update y'all with. So anyway, I'm out of breath, I'm hot. <laughs> so I'll see y'all in a minute. I probably when we about to go to the uh, grocery store. Um, I'm gonna leave out in like five minutes or so. So yeah, peace. First of all, I didn't even notice my damn <laughs> ghetto. That is ghetto. I didn't even notice that shit up there, y'all. But I don't care. I'm letting my little head wrap dry, girl. I went to the gym this morning, so please forgive me. But, girl, hold on. Wait. Hold on. I got another thing to say real quick, y'all. Real quick before we leave our whole up. Wait a minute. Let me put some pivot in it, baby. Y'all know it's every season, right? Ah! Today is March 22nd. Every season started yesterday. Baby? Yeah. So, what I had to do today pull out the Aries mug for my tea, y'all, but I'm so excited my birthday is coming. <laughs> I'm gonna update y'all, I'm gonna update y'all, I'm gonna update y'all. Trying to do TikTok and YouTube at the same time in the same day is crazy. Like, who signed me up for this? Who signed me up for this? Please let me know. Y'all, I'm so hot, it's crazy right now. Like, I forgot I had the heat on. And then I just put the air on. And I'm hot, I'm talking too much. I'm moving too much. Girl, <laughs> in the town way. That's hair, y'all. This Dior lip oil and lip glows and all this lip stuff Dior got me in the choke hole, baby. Hold up. See, you ghetto. Everything falling all over the place. Just ghetto. Anyway, y'all, I got three, baby. <laughs> three flavors of that um, Bootylicious Bubblegum. So this is the coral this one right here is actually a lip balm and then this one is berry so i usually like the universal clear but they was out of stock and i had the pink one before but that was out of stock too but the coral one let me show y'all real quick before i leave out <laughs> the coral one still look good it still show up clear i guess on my lips but it may show up a little different of course based on your lip color your natural lip color anyway y'all i need to be leaving out i'm off today so i don't really have to like you know <laughs> really rush my day <laughs> so i kind of take my time whatever i'm gonna wash my hair later y'all my hair look crazy underneath for this um and it's happy but just mind your business we are finally leaving out the house oh shit y'all i need to go get my little my little market bag. Hold on. Okay, now we ready. <laughs> so we are gonna try a new HEB that's not that far from me today. This one is a lot bigger. So, yeah, I'm excited. Lego. I like to grab a lot of these bags because sometimes I put stuff in there that don't even need to be in there. We're gonna do a 50 cent a piece. So let's do four. Oh, that one doesn't look good. Yeah, we're gonna do four. I know, I seen somebody comment before that they thought I was stealing when I put my stuff in this bag, y'all. This is a reusable bag. I am not stealing. Okay. I'm gonna grab two avocados for one dollar. Y'all, this is what I really want. Some 
damn banana put in something. But we gonna see you later. Uh, my birthday is coming. It's gonna be worth it. So it looks like my ground turkey that I get is on sale. So we're gonna grab one of these. This is the 93% lean, 7% fat. Y'all, it's so funny. People keep staring at me in here with this damn camera. This is the ground turkey I like to get. Well, not ground turkey, y'all. I'm just all over the place. This is the turkey I like to use for breakfast. It's another one I usually get too, but it's like dark green. But this one is good. I got a Celsius this morning for $2.99. They got them at $2.18 in here. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to think if I should grab a few. What's this one? Oh, I had this one before. But yeah, y'all, I can't believe I paid $2.99. Girl, they in here for $2.18. Yes, baby. This is exactly where I was looking to be, y'all. It took me a second to find it. This is my favorite. I think y'all already know that if you watch my channel. So we're gonna do two of these. Actually, they only got time of the day. Yeah, we're gonna do three. Fuck it, YOLO. <laughs> I might gotta play my birthday because I have seen 406 over the past two weeks so many times, but this is the eggs I am going to get. I think y'all already have seen them before. Make sure y'all check y'all eggs. Cause baby, sometimes they be cracked. These cookies right here, y'all, had me in the chokehold. These Nestle Toll House, girl, with some almond milk, girl. I only came here with $40, y'all. Y'all think it's gonna be $40? <laughs> I spent $36, y'all. I did great. Y'all, I am back at the crib, back in the crib. Let me fix my camera so I can show y'all what I got from the grocery store. Y'all still can't see me, goddamn. I guess this is the best it's gonna get, y'all. Let me flip my hat up because it look a little dark. <laughs> okay, that's better. So let me show y'all real quick. Even though I kind of showed y'all already while I was grocery shopping, but I'm going to show you again. And then we're going to make breakfast, girl, because I am starving. Okay, what time is it? 12 o'clock? Oh, it's 11. So, lemons. Uh, What is this? Avocado. We got the tuna fish on game. This is how people be when they want to show their money on Instagram. <laughs> ground turkey turkey sausage brown eggs watermelon y'all already know i'm about to dig in this for breakfast and look at my lineup of the celsius i got so i got some tropical vibe celsius this morning before i went to the gym so i got another one this is for my boo he want to try he never tried celsius before so he want to try celsius i told him he gonna like it but this is the tropical vibe one. I got this for him. And he also wanted to try mango passion fruit. So those two are for him. I'm gonna put them in the fridge. So next time I see them, you know, they'll be nice and cold. But the ones I got for myself is Arctic vibe, which I've had that one before. This one I've never had, orange pomegranate. Never had that. So I'm interested to try that. And then mango passion fruit. I've had this one. This one is really good. So, let me put my groceries away, then we gonna make breakfast, and then we gonna sit down and chat and catch up because I got a lot of clips that I've been like recording on my phone because I've been like, I've been going outside and doing stuff, but it has been so random. So the vlog would have just been all over the place if I would have vlogged every time I did stuff, but I did still get some footage, footage with my phone. Girl, I done went to the Houston Rodeo and everything, y'all, so y'all just... <laughs> Just stay tuned. So I just made breakfast, y'all. I'm on a calorie deficit right now. So I just made some ground turkey, cauliflower rice, eggs with hot sauce on top. This is bussing, okay? Bussing. So you should try it, but let's sit down, chat, and catch up. Y'all, not me look like somebody auntie. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Excuse me. I swear I be getting so many emails that I don't be knowing nothing about. But that's what happens when you keep signing up for a bunch of stuff. But um, yeah, y'all. I am on a calorie deficit, like I was saying. So until my birthday, after that girl is going out the window. So let me tell y'all. With now, I only been on it now for like four days. This is day four, but I've been doing so good, girl. So good. Do my hair scarf look crazy? <laughs> Anyway, first of all, don't judge, okay? This is where I need to be on to get to where I need to be by my birthday because I'm in crunch time right now. So I'm on a 1250 calorie deficit, 1,250. That is very, very low for calories. But you know, you just gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> so 
Um, for breakfast, it's recommended for me to have, let me see, 288 plus 87. What's that? 288 plus 87. 375 so it's recommended on the app based on now this app i use is called carb manager this is the same exact app i use to lose 30 pounds with keto so if you're trying to lose weight i know they some people use the other paper the fitness pal i've never tried that one but this carb manager one y'all fire this is the one i use like i said a couple years back when i did keto and obviously it worked so I just wanted to say that real quick but i put all my information in there how much i weigh right now um how much i work out what my goals are you gotta put all that stuff in there and then you pick what kind of plan you want to be on which mine is a high protein and then you put what your goal weight is and when you want to have that weight destined by whatever date um and then they tell you you know the breakdown of everything so this is my personal um goal tracker thing that they have set for me and it's free i don't pay for this i noticed yesterday my coffee that i made took up almost like 200 calories on its own y'all i know this probably is like girl we don't care for real but if y'all like stuff like this like talking about calories and working out and fitness and all this stuff because y'all already know i'm into that kind of stuff but this time i'm like actually back using the app so i'm serious about it i want a deep man because deep men don't work So I put my little heat wrap on so I ain't just talking to y'all with a head scarf on looking like somebody auntie. Anyway, y'all, so I don't even know why I'm being extra right now. I gotta sit down and all that, but it's just so much I gotta catch y'all up on. So I'm trying to go back a little bit on my phone to see all of what I've been doing because this is crazy. Okay, so me and my boot thing or whatever, we went to La La Land here in Houston. So they had an event that was actually not at La La Land, it was called the Kind. Y'all know like the Kind Snacks, K-I-N-D Snacks. I used to eat the bars and everything like probably like a couple years ago. But I came across this TikTok to where they was throwing a little event to where they are giving like free um, vegetables, fruits, nuts, all kinds of stuff like that, girl. And I was like, oh my gosh, I wanna go. So uh, La La Land was, is a coffee shop that I wanted to try in Houston so bad, but I just never made my way over there. And it was so funny that La La Land was right next to the event. But we didn't get a chance to go to the event, girl, because the line was long as hell. Like, the people was outside early. We got we got over that way probably like, what, 10? Maybe 11? When I tell y'all that event, that kind event, line was right around the corner girl i was like oh my gosh i was kind of mad though because i honestly didn't want to go y'all i want to get my free fruits and vegetables but we was like you know what it's cool whatever because we wasn't about to stand in line so we just went to la la land coffee shop y'all when i tell y'all the coffee shop is so stinking cute. Yo, it's so cute. It's so aesthetic vibes. I forgot which one I end up getting, y'all. What drink did I end up getting? I don't know, but I think I like mine. I like mine, but I like his better. I know he had an upside, upside down, something like that, latte. I think I had a French toast latte, something like that. I forgot which one I had, y'all, but it was so cute. I definitely will be going back on like a real full vlog and like show y'all again because the clips don't really do justice. We went to a taco truck that same day, I think later that night, and got some tacos, y'all. I tried for the very first time. What them tacos called that you dip uh, inside the sauce? Betty, Betty, yeah. Betty, Betty, yeah. Tacos, y'all. Fire. Okay. In the taco truck, it was called Taco Fuego. Y'all, when I tell y'all, that was probably the best tacos I ever had in my life. Definitely will be pulling up there again. Everything I'm telling y'all, I'm gonna redo, you know? So it's gonna be in the, like other vlogs later down the line, but I still wanted to tell y'all. And then, girl, we went to, this is probably another day. I think this was the next day. We went to Black Walnut Cafe for the first time. Girl, what's the Fort Mimosas called? Uh, we got a flight a piece. So we had four separate mimosas a piece, y'all, busting. It was a little lit after that. 
and then we got breakfast there of course the breakfast was good i got pancakes i originally got french toast but i didn't like the french toast so i ended up switching out for pancakes and then girl we went to the houston rodeo now all this stuff was not in the same weekend i'm telling y'all these was like random ass days so we went to the houston rodeo girl when i tell you that houston rodeo was lit honey no people came outside okay so we went to the Houston Rodeo for the first time, girl. So I was so excited. I had uh, a turkey leg. Girl, that turkey leg was $20 OD, but I still paid for it. What else I had? I had a Mexican corn. Yo, when I tell y'all that's the best Mexican corn I ever had, fire, okay? Uh, what else I have? I had fried Oreos for the very first time. Never tried fried Oreos before. Oh, and I've tried fried cheesecake. Oh my gosh, y'all. I wanted to eat more. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I went to the rodeo to eat. Like, that was my point. I went there, of course, for the experience because I never been. But the goal was to eat as much as I can. <laughs> but I didn't get on no rides. I don't do rides, but they had a lot of rides. They had a lot of food. We went to go see the, um, with the stinking ass animals. Them animals. Yeah, them animals, they stink. But we knew, we went to go see the animals. Um, we didn't go to like a the rodeo show. But baby, everybody came up with their cowboy boots on, with their hats and all that. I try to be, you know, in theme a little bit, but I thought it was gonna be cold, girl. I thought it was gonna be a little chilly. So I wore jeans, some Converse's, and like a crop top with a little vest. And girl, I get out there and they all got shorts on. It feel hotter when we got to the rodeo. So I'm like, damn, I could have worn my shorts and whatever. But anyway, we're going to go next year again. So so let me tell y'all about my birthday. Because my birthday is coming up, girl. And yeah, so my sister and Tanise is coming in too. <laughs> I'm excited. Can you tell? <laughs> So my sister and Denise is flying in, baby. I have not seen my sister in like a year. <laughs> y'all, I literally haven't seen my sister in a, almost a year. Like, y'all know me and my sister is like this. Like, we locked in. That's my best friend. So the fact that I haven't, like, really seen my sister in a whole year is just crazy to me. Like, anyway, I ain't going to talk too much about it because I might start crying. <laughs> But I'm excited, y'all. We supposed to be having a good time. Evan gonna come down here too. Y'all saw Evan already. I went up to Dallas to go visit Evan. So she gonna come. Kita couldn't make it, but it's okay. You know, shout out to Kita anyway. Cause Kita is an Aries as well. Tanise is an Aries. Um, my other homegirl is an Aries. It's just like, we all lit around here. My sister is a Leo though. So she's still in the fire sign. But anyway, girl, yes, my sister now is coming and I'm so excited. We booked a section at a club called Space Houston. So let me know if y'all ever been there before. It look like they get lit, okay? They get lit. So we trying to have a good old time. And then I'm trying to figure out some other stuff that I'm planning for them. So I got a few vlogs that's coming up, y'all. So <laughs> ah, I'm excited. I'm gonna have a birthday maintenance vlog. I'm gonna have a birthday vlog. Probably had like two of those. So yeah, y'all. Anyway, I talked y'all enough. Let me edit this TikTok, y'all. And I'm gonna catch up with y'all later, probably after I done did my hair and stuff. Cause girl, I'm trying to do this and fucking edit. And it's just, it just be too much. And plus I gotta let my camera charge. So anyway, that's it. I see y'all in a couple of hours, peace. Two hours later. Y'all, my hair is dry. Uh, I just got to curl it when I'm about to leave out. But we about to relax for a little bit, girl. And I want to talk to y'all about something. <laughs> so first and foremost, y'all, I have been watching Queen's Court. I don't know if y'all have um, seen that before, but it's off of Peacock, girl. I was so mad because they first let me watch the first episode for free. And then I got all hype. And then I'm like, now I want to watch the rest of this the season. But girl, ain't nobody paying. I ain't want to pay that $5. I paid it, but I ain't want to. <laughs> I ain't want to, but I paid it. So, Queen's Court is Evelyn on here, Tamar Braxton, and Nivea. You know, Nivea, the one who used to sing the song, you know, the, the one hit wonder. No, let me stop. <laughs> I just don't like her on this show. Like, I, I've never really seen Nivea really talk for real or like her personality. So, I really, really caught me off guard that she act like this. And it's like, it's nothing wrong with having a personality because I think, you know, I have a little extra personality. And I found out she had Aries. So, anyway, 
back to the story so i was so mad i was like oh my god she doing too much but on the show it's like it's nothing wrong with having a personality but i personally feel like when you first meet men i don't feel like you should be you know all goofy like that you know what i'm saying like you you gotta kind of like if you know you have that loud boastful kind of personality you want to be yourself for sure but you gotta kind of reel it back a little bit when you first meet a guy like it's like she meeting these guys and she just talking about sex already and just being all <laughs> like too goofy or something and it's just like i don't like that it's like you're too grown to be acting like that girl but it's not wrong with acting like that like after you after you like you know you been with your man for a little bit you know and he he kind of know you like that all right cool but first date first impression girl you doing too much i just don't like it i'm sorry um so yeah nivia i'm not a fan of her on this show uh personally i don't know the lady but i'm not a fan of her on this show but i do i've always loved evelyn i've always loved evelyn since basketball wives so i like evelyn on the show she's still giving classy as she's always gave and then i love tamar on the show surprisingly because tamar sometimes be doing too much too I got the nerve to try to say somebody do too much as as extra as I am. But, you know, I'm not on TV. <laughs> I don't know if this show is just fake or not. But they supposedly got proposed after the show. So, we shall see. But, girl, that's what I'm doing. So, i catch up with y'all when I figure out what I'm doing for the rest of the day. You know what? I've been doing good, though. I'm very physical. So, I love a man that can do stuff with his hands. And pizza is my favorite food. So, I want to see if they can, like, sway me or give me something I never had before. I did my hair. It's kind of look a little weird a little bit. Like, I need to curl more right here. I don't know. But, overall looks pretty good to me it's definitely growing back so i don't have anything on crazy y'all got a body suit from where i get this body suit from oh my gosh aritzia i'm kind of chilling but still you know looking pretty cash and cute for a wednesday and then can y'all see me for real i got some yoga pants with some Tory Burch slides in this yellow bag. I need to spray a little bit of Ebony Wood on. I put a little bit on, but I feel like it kind of like wore off a little bit. So, where are we going? That's the question. <laughs> where are we going is the question, honey. Oh, I'm just so fine, girl, just so fine. I ain't put no lashes on, I barely did my eyebrows, but I do need a new camera holder for the car. I really want to look in my apartment, like everywhere in my apartment first before I buy a new one because I know I'm not crazy. I know I'm not crazy. So I might hold off on that. I do want to go to Zara as always, what's new? Um, I want to go to this spot that I saw, I forgot the name of it, but get like a salad. They got a little happy hour start from three to four or three to six. I think that's what it was. And then I want to go to Kung Fu Milk Tea. So let's go get some food first. Um, and then while we over there, we're going to stop by the mall or I might do the mall first. I don't know, girl, but whatever. We better leave out. Shit. It's three o'clock. It's time to go. Okay. Time to enjoy the day off. We are here, y'all, at the mall. I just pulled up not too long ago. Y'all, I just posted a tiki tock, tiki tiki tock, tiki tiki tock, tock, tiki tiki tock, tock. Y'all, tick tock. Look, I'm trying. I'm trying my best. I'm not trying my best. I'm lying. I'm trying though, for sure. I'm not trying my best. I can do better. But follow me on TikTok, y'all. If y'all not follow me already, girl, I'm trying to post like little mini vlogs on there and stuff. Just post things that don't think too much about it. You know what I'm saying? But we had them all. Um, I'm going for Forever 21 first, and then I'm gonna go in Zara, and then I might stick my head in something else. Who knows, y'all? I really shouldn't be buying nothing because my birthday is coming up, and I don't even know with all i'm wearing for like my birthday weekend because baby we celebrate the whole weekend not just one day okay so i also wanted to say ah! i meant to tell y'all so i ran into one of my booze when i was out at lost and found and i was y'all i might gotta tell y'all this when i get home because no i can tell y'all right now fuck it i can tell y'all right now so it caught me off guard y'all i ain't even gonna lie it really caught me off guard like i know i post content on youtube or whatever like that and i know i do live in houston i know that but it's like i wouldn't think that nobody would recognize me like i don't feel like my following i don't 
fo- first of all, your following don't have to be super big for people to notice you. It's only was it was only one person. I'm not trying to say it like that, but I just was like little old me, like hey girl. So when she was like, she I don't need, she didn't even tell me her name. I didn't even ask her name, but I was waiting at Lost and Found, you know, sitting down waiting or whatever on the outside. And girl, if you see this video, make sure you comment below, girl, because, yeah, I need to know your name. So, anyway, I'm waiting at Lost and Found, right? And then I get, like, closer to the front, and there was a girl. She was like, hey, do you do you do you do be doing YouTube? And I'm like, yeah. She was like, oh, my God, I'll be watching your channel. Oh, my God, you me. I feel like uh, that was, like, a little moment for me, y'all. I couldn't believe it, honestly. It really caught me off guard. I ain't even going to hold you. It really caught me off guard. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, like that means that people are seeing my content in Houston. Like, even though granted, you know, obviously I have Houston vlogs and my analytics say that Houston people are viewing it, but it's it's different when somebody recognize you in person. It's like, dang. Oh, I felt special. But anyway, girl, shout out to you, girl. If you see this video, hey girl. Mm. So it's hot now, y'all. I didn't even know it was going to be this hot outside. And I don't even know why I put the air on just now. No, I'm about to get out the car. But, y'all, also, I thought that this this coral um, Dior lip gloss was more clear. But I don't know why today it looked like it's pink. I don't know. Maybe I wasn't in the right light. But, <laughs> baby, we might as well throw in a Dior shade since we got a Dior lip gloss. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Keep it cute. Let's go. Y'all, I'm so mad I thought Azara was in the mall. Like, why did I think Azara was in that mall? I'm not going to another mall. I'm kind of tired, honestly, y'all. I'm going to try to make this happy hour really quick to get a salad. Um, It's like, do I really want to go there for a salad, though? They make a salad at home. <laughs> uh, Do I want to go there for a salad? It's like for the salad and for the vibes, though. I'm really debating. Like... It's like 15, 20 minutes from where I'm at. And I'm like, do I want to drive 15, 20 minutes for a damn salad? Or do I just want to go get my damn Kung Fu tea and go home? It's giving go get my Kung Fu tea and go home. If the Kung Fu tea place is closer than this place, I'm going to get my Kung Fu tea and I'm going home. Damn, that's 20 minutes too. God damn, where the hell am I at? <laughs> uh, so we going to go get the Kung Fu tea. And then we're going to go home. The one that I'm going to get today is going to be something that's like low in calories. And it's going to be something new. I'm tired of talking about fucking calories at this point. Bitch, give me a donut. Okay, I'm not going to do it. But at this point, give me a damn donut. <laughs> I lied, y'all. Kung Fu Tea Place, once I started actually driving, was only eight minutes away. So, <laughs> Y'all, I was looking on a menu and looking at their um, breakdown of everything. I think I'm going to try the honey green tea we're actually going to do it in a large that's only 65 cows so i sound crazy even talking like that but anyway y'all let's go <laughs> that's only 65 cows oh my god i have to count my calories <laughs> green tea in a large so no boba today uh, i really wanted boba but we're gonna see mm, this is still good though of course my screen gets dark because of my sunglasses but mm, this is really good wow anyway i'm gonna chill out here for a second and then we're going to go to the house and make a salad. Y'all, I'm so irritated right now. I will tell y'all about it when I get in the house. Like, I think my day is just ruined. I tell y'all though, it's crazy. This vlog is about to end right here. Like, 
I'm so irritated, it's ridiculous. So let me tell y'all real quick what happened. Basically, y'all know the last clip before the clip that I told y'all I was gonna come home and tell y'all what happened. I was, you know, thinking I'm cute and cool, getting out, going to Kung Fu Tea, and left my keys in the car. Locked my keys and my phone in the car, by accident, of course. As soon as I closed my car door, I immediately knew that I locked the keys in there, and I was like, what the fuck? Only thing I can say, y'all, is that I did keep my composure. Like, I still went and got my tea, as y'all saw keeping it cute and regular. When I showed y'all the tea, when I'm drinking the tea, at that point, my keys was already locked in the car. But I was just so calm about it. Like, I'm calm about it. I drink my tea. I try to like, of course, do dumb shit and try to fund, fundle with the door and went in different stores asking them like, hey, you think it's something I can use to kind of open the car door? I lock my keys. They like, no, no, no. Everybody like, no, no, no. So I'm like, fine. I'm just have to find somebody phone to use and call like Papa Lock or either my insurance. So I go in the UPS store. They let me use their phone. They looked up the phone number for me because y'all, my phone was locked in the car too. Call the damn Papa Lock people. They like, okay, cool. I give them an address to, to the UPS. The UPS store is about to close in like five minutes. So I'm like, look, I don't have my phone. You won't be able to call me when y'all outside or whatever. So I'm gonna just, you know, keep an eye out for the Papa Lock car. And y'all know, if you don't know, I'm used to a Papa Lock car having a little Papa Lock sign on top of the car. You know how Domino's got the Domino sign? It's like that with the Papa Lock sign. So anyway, chilling, whatever, trying to stay positive and calm, whatever, walking around. At this point, I just look lost and stupid. So anyway. I'm like, yo, it's been over 30 minutes because they told me 30 minutes. So I'm like, I don't have no clock to reference, but I'm like, it feels like it's been longer than 30 minutes. So I'm just sitting on my car, looking around, looking around. Then this guy come talk about some, hey, are you looking for Papa Lock? I'm like, yeah, I don't see, you know, a car with the Papa Lock sign. He like, oh, I don't have that. But I'm the Papa Lock guy. He had a Papa Lock shirt on too. But so he like, yeah, I've been driving around. Uh, trying to really find out who needed, you know, the car service, whatever like that. I was looking for a UPS store. And he claimed he was driving around, which I appreciate him. I'm not even going to be rude about that because he didn't have to do all that. He could have just drove around a few and left, to be real. But the fact that he said he was driving around a lot trying to find me, I did appreciate him for that. So he did, you know, unlock the door or whatever like that, y'all. The whole process probably was a total of like two hours like all in all it probably took about two hours for everything to get done so i'm back home now obviously and i'm irritated unnecessary money had to be spent i don't even want to talk about how much it costs and honestly y'all the first thing was not to think about is turn on the damn camera talking about so hey guys i'm locked out like no bitch i was <laughs> i was pissed off but i'm trying to stay calm and i'm just like you know what i just talk about it when i get home but y'all i'm gonna eat a salad i'm i'm, I'm done recording I'm, I'm just being honest with y'all i'm gonna get in the shower i'm gonna eat a salad and i'm gonna finish watching queen's court so hopefully y'all still enjoyed the vlog i still had a good time on the vlog but your girl is pissed off about having to spend that unnecessary money but i can't be mad at nobody but myself so anyway i'm off again on friday i gotta go to the dermatologist so <gasps> Excuse me, possibly I may vlog again on Friday. So we shall see y'all. Anyway, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you do not like the video, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all for clicking on that video. And I will see you guys in my next vlog. Even though I'm pissed off, I'm going to still give y'all the energy. You know? <laughs> Peace.